Alrighty. Anyway, here we go. This drive here, let me turn a light on here above the desk. Maybe that'll help a little bit. But anyway, these are sold on Amazon. I haven't seen many people looking at these things. Well, I should say, I haven't seen anybody do any reviews on these things. But here, let me just kind of see if I can get this focus. You can get the part number right there. Okay, see, it says it's a two terabyte drive. I will show you it's not a two terabyte drive here in a moment. I'm going to disassemble one of these. I got a couple of them. Um, they are three, or give me, give me a tack it back. 32 gig is what Chip Genius says is inside these. That's what Chip Genius says. I mean, whether or not it's true or not, I don't know. But these, I mean, it has a USB-C on the end. I mean, it's got this nice little aluminum case, which seems like it's pretty neat. You know, I mean, it looks, it feels solid. But I'm almost betting that when I open this up, that the it's just going to go back to about right here, and it's going to have some, like, little memory chip on it, and that's going to be about it. Um, but I'm going to disassemble this. Let me uh, get a pick here, see if I got a pick I can use um see if I can figure out how to take these things apart because honestly I've never took one of these apart before um and um probably destroy it taking it apart but you know it all depends I guess um looking to see is there any particular way to take it apart Without, I mean, just totally destroying it? Probably not. I, I don't know which end of this will come apart, which will not come apart. You know, whatever. I'm just, we're going to go digging. I just have to make sure I don't go digging into my fingers with this thing. I mean, if I scratch it up, it's not a real big deal. But, I will post this video on um, Amazon once I get done with it. I will post this on Amazon. So, you know, anybody that's looking at this fine piece of equipment. Dang, my pick bent. Did you see that? I took a, um, or I should say, I've got a little microscope digital microscope i could use when i'm doing this but if i use it um it goes way out of focus so let's see if we can do it this way oh looky there hey looky there looky there all right so that's a sticker and then there's some Phillips head screws underneath that. Um, so let's see what's inside here. Like I, said, I will post this on uh, YouTube on my channel just because i mean you know, if it saves somebody the trouble of getting one of these and i mean it's bad enough if you buy something like this expecting it to be exactly what they say it is and then you end up with something that don't work that is irritating come on whoa i just popped off in my eyes but hey there it is now you can see up in there it's just a little circuit board um you know here's the question oh here we go looky looky there okay so now we got it to there uh it's fine where's their tape end at here yeah, obviously, I'm not going to try to sell these to anybody else. I mean, because, you know, it's 
bad enough one person gets ripped off. And I, you know, if I can use them for something else, I mean, at least I got some little short USB cables out of it, I guess. You know, they got a, like a USB-A to USB-C cable that comes with them. So, yeah, we'll see. But we're going to open this all the way up here and see what's actually inside here. Because... You're kind of taking this little journey with me. I'm thinking it's probably going to have some kind of like little SD card or something inside here. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah. I'm thinking that's what it was. It was like, a, just, because it, it only read, wrote and read at like, uh, well, it read at like 20 meg per second. Oh, look, there it is. It is a, lucky, check it out. It is a little USB drive. That's what it is. It's a USB A. Yeah, show it. It's a USB A to USB C adapter with a little USB drive. Which this thing, you you can tell. I mean, you know, you look at it. It's got the black, so it uh, means it's not a um, you know USB three, as they said. They said it was a USB three on the box if you uh yeah look at the specs here on the box it says it's uh you know usb3 sata3 blah 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 um yeah and then it says it's a usb c 3.1 port provides higher speed well not really because you can only be as fast as the slowest part and the slowest part is this yeah so anyway yeah even though they say it's all this stuff and seeing even says it's a you know our it says it's an m.2 <laughs> yeah um no it's not but check that out uh let's see if we can get you to zoom just or well get that to focus just a little bit better so if you see these on amazon avoid them because they're definitely not what they say they are um as you can see let's say it is an adapter for usb c to usb a and then it's got a little thumb drive and this thing only has 32 gigs of ram uh there yeah, or you know storage on it even though they say it's two terabytes it's 32 gigs. I'm going to see if I can reflash this drive and make it so that it will at least be a usable 32 gig, you know, USB stick I can use on a Raspberry Pi or something, or even just to use it to install you know, operating systems on computers, you know, just load like a Windows image or Linux or whatever on there to uh, have. But um, yeah, I will post this on. Amazon. I might even post a link to it on my um, Twitter. Um, I don't really do Instagram anymore. But yeah, this thing here is just a fancy little hunk of aluminum that has a slot cut in it uh, for that little card to slide up in there. Yeah, there's. It's not an actual M.2 drive. Don't fall for it. I mean, I figured you know, hey, if uh, I can save somebody a dollar or two, I think I think these things are like 50 bucks a piece on Amazon. So, you know, thing is I buy so much off of Amazon that, you know, I get a full refund pretty much if I uh, tell them I, uh, you know, you know, somebody sold a fake thing to me or whatever, usually they'll end up giving me a refund on it and, you know, tell me to keep it half the time. Sometimes not, but half the time they'll just tell me to keep it. So there you go. If y'all have any questions, you know, you can leave me a comment, you know, like, like, subscribe, all that other stuff if you want to. If you don't want to, that's fine and dandy with me because, you know, I just, I do this just as a uh, hobby. I'm retired. So, you know, yeah, if y'all, you know, want anything, you know, or want me to check something out, you know, send me a message or something. Uh, you can always contact me through my uh, 
Twitch or my Twitter. Uh, it's, you know, Mad Mods for you. Um, you know, I'll try my best to answer you as soon as possible, but I am an old, old fella, so I don't, uh, yeah, I don't camp out on there like, you know, some of these teenagers do. But uh, I appreciate y'all have a good one, and uh, we'll uh, see if this, uh, you know, helps anybody or not. Later.